back in my land to the next travel with me for ASB Vlogs via also with Father Lara and I. As I said, I'm educating you all based on certain townships that is run on for its history here in South Island. So the next stopover we did was to a Puha Waikiki Point Lighthouse or it's known as Jack's Point Lighthouse house which was basically standing near to Timaru at the east coast of the south island of New Zealand. Obviously it stands at 5 kilometres 31 3.1 miles south of South Timaru. It can be reached via New Zealand State Highway 1 from the smallest standard point mint on Scarborough. Approx 40 metres 130 foot further landwards passes the south island main trunk railway of the building which you can will see obviously on the map where it's located along also a few imagery as I go along as I discuss this. The place is named after obviously the Maori chief Honey Jack to a Waikiki where it obviously came from which who he belonged to the tribe of Ngai Tahu. The history of the lighthouse was installed in 1903 at its current location where you see it when it was replaced the insufficient beacon of Tamaru Harbour. It had then been built in 1866 from cast iron and was used in, until 1900 on Somme's Island in the Wellington Harbour until a new tower was built there. It was automated one year after being relocated and since 1930 it was operated without staff. It is still being used till today. If you're wanting to know more about certain parts as I shared with you all about when I'm educating you the history of some landmarks in New Zealand, what it's famous for and what have you, especially in the South Island which I said is enriched with history obviously more than in North Island sadly. I'll link up some resources in the description box below you yeah, as well as some other information that might be of relevance to you hence maybe location points versus everything else. So again sit tight chameleons to see what is installed with you guys on my road trip all the way down to the South Island and back again and I'll see you soon. Wish I was on this, folks. Woo woo. Don't know where it's going, but we have to wait and see. You can see, I'm walking up the lighthouse backdrop of the mountaineer. This is a train. And at the far end there where Father Lai is heading for is a lighthouse, which I'll show you another view close up. But out here, as you can see, excuse the background noise, is the sea. But leading out to where I'm hoping to show you. But like I said, the main point of this trekking is this Jackson Lighthouse. I'll show you from a closer viewpoint. Stay tuned. See that boat guys? Goodness knows where that's heading to. Spot the loud noisy waves. Again, we're getting near to that lighthouse up there. Coming down, obviously this is the shoreline. Obviously must have flooded the last thing behind the scenery. Don't want to dive in there, it's looked too rough today guys actually. So much for that. But I'm sure you're bound to see me on one of my adventures braving it out on the waters. But we'll have to wait and see where that takes me. Right, Fire? You won't get in the water. Huh, very funny. But we'll have to wait and see, won't we? Two, one, go. As always, here we go, fire. Oh. Sorry, guys, working out at Jackson's Point. <laughs> it's a very small lighthouse, but. Hmm. I agree. But it's. Very noisy as well. Yeah, well, fits Espy, doesn't it? For a little tiny homes. You might need to buy it then. Yeah, I know, right? 